Yo guys, so I'm gonna go on a little rant right now. So I woke up super duper excited because we're posting our first CBT fitness video here that I finally just got up and I've been trying to post it for probably three hours and first thing that happened was I forgot to handbrake it so it was taking hours and hours to upload on YouTube until I finally realized that I had to handbrake that shit. So I did that but the whole time my computer has been breaking down because the fucking charger just doesn't work anymore for some reason. So I gotta get that checked out, but my mom gave me her laptop to fix that and I finally got it up. So super happy about that, but I gotta go to the gym now and take out all my anger on those weights. So let's get it. But first we gotta go make some pre-workout. If you wanna check out that video, I'd really appreciate it. It's on CBT Fitness, as you can see. CBT Fitness right there for the uh, juicy lat workout, but we're actually gonna hit a back workout today as well, so you can follow along with this one if you want. fucking cold man this is how long I was working on that goddamn video I woke up at like 12 hold on what the fuck I woke up at like 12 and I'm just now going to the gym and the Sun is almost completely set four o'clock solid dude left lane cruiser baby left lane cruiser you already know Vlogging and driving is actually a lot harder than it looks. I'm trying to, this is like my first time trying it and it's fucking very difficult. Right. We have arrived at the gym, so you know what that means. It's time to initiate the montage. I fucking hate how goddamn high this bar is. Look at this. I can't even reach that shit. I gotta jump one arm style, monkey style. We are, we are reaching for the stars, but we're making this do hard. And I wonder where you
exercise. I see a lot of people put one knee up on the bench like this and hold it with their other arm. But what you really want to do is get both legs with the bench in the middle because it lowers the risk for um, hernia injury. And I learned that from Jeff Cavalier Athlete X. So that's how you know it's legit. All right, I gotta stop training lats now where I might you know, fly right through the ceiling and then I'm gonna have to pay for damages and whatnot. So let's move on. Just finished up the workout and this is pretty much how every day goes now over college break wake up either edit a video or take some of my online class and then go to the gym come on out and it's just pitch black freezing and depressing but hey it's how it's gonna go so it's how it's gonna go and uh, you can't let it bring you down you know you gotta stay up stay up high all right guys, so I'm at the grocery store right now and if you know me in real life, you know that my relationship with food is pretty horrible. I basically hate almost every single food. If I could eliminate my taste buds permanently, I 100% would on the spot. And I barely ever eat meat, so it's tough for me to get protein in. So basically I'm just gonna go through the store and try to find food that I'm capable of eating, which is gonna be quite difficult because as I said, it's always been hard for me to get calories in and I'm currently trying to eat 3600 calories a day which is quite a lot if you don't know because I'm bulking and so I need to go in there and find some fucking food that I can eat so that I can get big and strong you know so here we go all right just got done in the store and I'll show you what I got when I get home because it is freezing out here so. all right so now I'm gonna show you what I got from the store is all of it. 